Let's play some more sticks. You like my little duckbill beanie? Yeah, it's growing on me. At first I thought it looked like a uh, a bonnet. And I found that a little bit disturbing, to be honest. But uh, it's growing on me. It's growing on me. Just gather some supplies if we need to. Do I have... No. I don't have any skill points. I have no skills. What's going on, Ozcan? What are we doing? Hey, what are Sticks. we doing today? So, did you manage to find Barryman's secret room? Yes. It's his personal office, and bad news. He's keeping track of you. Ha <laughs> don't you worry. It's been a while since I had old Barryman running in circles. But he's got nothing on me. Oh, you are sadly mistaken. He's found one of your hiding places. The one on the docks? <laughs> yes, I know. It's a false trail that I left for him. Blind as I am, I wouldn't survive two days in this chaos if I didn't have a bit of brains. Always one step ahead, huh? And here I was worried about you. You should know that in his secret room, there is a system that allows him to listen to all the atrium. Probably built it to listen to you. What are you shitting me? And to think that some said that I was too careful. At least I'm not rotting in some dungeon. There's some good to be said for the sewers, don't you think? We got lucky, you mean. In any case, this information is priceless. If I can do something for you, just ask. As it happens, I'd like you to help me to go somewhere. So, my friend. Where are you off to this time? In prison. What? In prison? It's a bit like stepping into the lion's den, wouldn't you say? When I step into a lion's den, it's to fuck a lion. Now, I got someone to free. Oh well, it's very honorable of you. Be careful all the same. This is not any old prison. Life expectancy is short, and nobody ever returns. You're sure he's still in one piece, your friend? I'm certain of it. He's in cell five. If anyone can survive in there, it's him. Oh yeah? And who is he? Do I know him? It's... Damn, this headache. It makes me want to whack myself. And not in a good way. Man, I could really use some amber. But I can't stop now, can I? Listen, if you go in there... You'll see they have laboratory equipment, the best there is. If you could find me a bulb condenser. A what? You got a problem with your bulbs? Man, that's harsh. Try putting a little cream on them. Works for me. A bulb condenser. It's a piece of alchemist's equipment used in distillation. It's made of glass, very fragile, very rare, and worth a fortune. Bulbs made of glass? Worth the fortune, yeah. I knew that. However, if you bring it back to me in bits, I'll pay you nothing. I'm no novice. Good. Let's go to prison. They're expecting me. <coughs> He's got bulbs of glass. Like laying on the uh, crude jokes. Thickly there, right? Well, that was awesome. Now, um, guess we're okay. We're gonna have to de rust, I suppose. Wow, I can't see anything. <laughs> I can't see anything right now. It's bright in this room and this game is so effing dark. I honestly can't see jack or shit. This might be an issue. Hey. So, um, okay. 
Mission start. That's what I was looking for right there. Let's just make it to the mission start. There we go. So this is um one of the harder missions. If you're trying to get all the tokens. Anyway. Now by the look of these maps, this is the elevator that leads to the prison. The mechanism to activate it shouldn't be far. Let's take a look. Ah, perfect. Oh, so we're not even to the prison yet. Oh wow. These levels are gigantic. Is this the first time we've seen this? Have we already been here? I thought this was one of the first levels in the game and it's been so long since I started playing the game that I forgot. But I think, yeah, I think this is our second time through this level. This is um us beginning our backtrack through the game, which, yeah, which was bound to happen eventually and looks like it's started now. So... We're going to a mechanism to do something. Okay. Any guys about? Also, where can I go? Oh, hey guys, what's up? What's up? <clears throat> You're not coming this way. Fair enough. was close. I think this guy moves here. Yes. Um, I think a little bit more leniency and freedom of... freedom to move. There's plenty of freedom of movement, but just freedom to move, you know, would have been great in this game. Because there, like, I was just trying to find a path through and I jump up, escaping the guys coming towards me, and half the people on the other side of the map, which there are like 15, <laughs> almost spot me. Yeah. But anyway. I should really be paying attention to the patrols here, which I'm not. I'll wait for this guy to turn and go. Hopefully I don't wake this guy up popping out of the barrel here. I feel like this guy should be... ...headed somewhere. See, I like that. I like that. That guy paused. He paused for a bit. I was like, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, stand in one location for a good amount of time and not be so antsy. Um, that's, uh, I like that patrol. My bad. My bad little patrol he's got there. I think I will. Oh, 
definitely head through there. He doesn't look over here. Make past this guy. There was some guy over here. He's moving back though. Good. Does he come this way? Whoa! Yeah, beast. You yeah, beasted. See, I was, I was gonna put myself on that corner, thinking he would come around, right around that corner. But uh, yeah, not the case. I need to drop down here before that guy spots me. Um. If I'm gonna play reactionary, I need to have my throwing knives available. I only have two out of three throwing knives. Well, we need to keep, there was one back there, but I'm not gonna backtrack after it. We need to keep an eye out for another throwing knife. Because if I'm playing reactionary, I wanna be able to quickly toss them and kill if somebody spots me. Um, and I'm not in a position to where I can corner kill. Yeah, I'm done with the... That guy just stands in that one spot. I'm done with the... Reloading type of... Gameplay. Wow. Wow. Oh, that's why I didn't notice that guy, because he's on a patrol and wasn't looking over here originally. I was like, what the... How did I not see that guy? I need to take a look, see what's going on down here. Got those guys up there. Got no way through here. Could go down those stairs there, maybe. I don't let one of these guys see me. I wonder if I can push that guy off. I can probably push him off the ledge, right? If I should oh wow he has a tight little patrol here huh what the fuck is he what's he doing okay this guy down here luckily is going the other way the first one i find doing nothing will be on the train duty down here. Uh, we are actually headed up there though. This may be the safer the safer route. Even all the guys up here. But these three guys don't seem to be moving. The path is clear and I don't think anybody over there would see me if... Yeah, we snuck through here. I think I saw something over there. Who was that? I must have been you mean to tell me those guys... Yeah, whatever. They were looking the other way. That's cool. Did I 
that's the thing about this. You gotta think in like layers. I'm thinking one layer at a time, like the layer directly in front of me. What the hell? Really? Uh, but you need to think like two or three layers down the line. You know? You need to look farther ahead in the distance because there are guys, so many guys, everywhere. So. I think I see a dagger in this room, so I'm just gonna have a little detour here. And after this guy passes by. I don't want to patrol on this. Or if this cleaning guy has a patrol. But what? But anyway, I need to do that. Make it dark enough to where I can sneak over here right beside him. It's pitch black. Is there not a way up over here? Really thought you could climb this thing. So even though it's pitch black and he's looking down, the next time you won't escape me. He still has good enough peripheral vision. Okay, well, I mean, whatever. Good to know. So a little bit. I mean, it's goblin mode, but hey, I guess they their way of making it more difficult is by increasing the AI awareness. It may be better just to play it on normal difficulty, to be honest. I mean, I think I prefer Thief's way of making missions more difficult, which is just adding more objectives. And having, you know, the one standard. Enemy awareness. Is this dick really going to lean here? Is he really? Be ready. There's a creature lurking around here. Okay, I'm about to say that would be the most dickish move. Jesus. About that move. Ooh, ooh! How did those guys not notice? I guess because they're not looking up, really. But uh, where are we going now? No. Oh. Yeah, they really try to. They really try to catch you there. Can I pull, pull this guy off the ledge? Oh, I can't seem to move here, so I, I have. Shit. I must have been dreaming. No, oh, no. Can I make that? Found nothing suspicious. I think I can, right? If I dangle here. Oh shit! This one's for me! Who in the world? Whatever. Come on, you scared. Show yourself. Where Is that guy even there? 
I don't know, sometimes when you drop off ledges, they just... Their line of sight is wonky at times. I kind of... I would almost recommend, like, to play on normal difficulty. Because, like, even... Like, Expert... I mean... It almost makes the game... Veer off from challenging to unfair territory if you're trying to ghost it really does so I would almost recommend like s steering away from goblin mode if you can I mean I've got 250 plus hours in this game if I can't successfully if I haven't gotten the hang of sneaking around and I still can't pick up on where guards are so, and things like that. Cell five is not in this part of the prison, but in the high security section. <sighs> still got a ways to go. Better get. Just when it's when it's on Goblin, it depends a little bit too much Don't move. I'm on knowing the uh -huh. well, just like the, the AI man. jank, you know. And like knowing I must avoid these shitty spellcasters. If you drop from a ledge, even though they have no line of sight on you, they are going to it's gonna cause a glitch that forces the guard to see you. That kind of thing. So we're activating the levers to the east and west wing. Picky's good this week. Some interesting trinkets, yes. People have plenty of imagination when it comes to buying a little dignity. When do we share it out? Soon, I hope. I have debts to repay. I'll go and see if those. I just wanted to speed up that process. I didn't. I didn't like the fact that the game wanted me to stand there and listen to the conversation. Is that just a gap in the texture right there? I think it is. So I've made it here. <clears throat> hmm. Would be neat if you could jump and like swing off of those spears right there, but I don't think you can. Once again, like um. I know Styx has hops and they want to show that off, but at the same time, like, I would love it if it was just clear as to whether or not I can jump up here and <laughs> grab onto this or not. And I can't hear anything. I think because there's a separation um, between sound out here in this area and sound in here. Well, I can hear that guy a little bit. I should be able to hear him more. Everything all right. Sorry, I'm being really nitpicky. It's just like in a stealth game, the sound is important. So. Why did that guy move? Okay, I thought he was just gonna stand right in the middle there like a weirdo. So So of course we've got one, two, three guys patrolling in this room, maybe more and there's more up top, of course. Three plus guys, four plus. I forgot the armored guy. There's another armored guy. I thought he was in that back room, but uh, and I think there's yeah, there's a guy right there to spot you if you jump up there. So just guys everywhere. Uh, yeah. Man, really. Um, yeah, I think if if I 
jumped up. I'm trying to guess the AI's jank here. Um, like I want to jump here to this ledge. Uh, spitball with sand that torch. So he has a, a less chance of seeing me. Um, <laughs> of course it may be safer just to drop straight off and under the table. Um, he may slightly see me. Like that. Lucky made it through that. Lucky nobody happened to be looking this way. I kind of wonder if they increased the number of AI. We have two guys, one guy above us. Bohort, open up. I know Nobody upstairs as far as I'm aware. I, I don't think there's anybody up there. Where the heck did this guy go? There was a guy walking towards us. Where did he go? The fact that I can't hear where guys... Oh, he's right there. The fact that I couldn't hear him... <laughs> I thought he walked this way. I thought he did, but the fact that I couldn't hear him walk up the stairs, creak along the boards, and clank in his armor, it's just the, sh the sound should be better, man. I know I'm nitpicking, I I'm not trying to review this game at the same time I'm playing it. Actually, I am, but you know. It's just, um, you know, what I'm thinking of, I'm just sharing my thoughts here. You know, so now we have two guys staring off in this direction. Uh, okay, the opening is now this way. If this guy's peripheral vision is not incredibly sensitive. Doesn't appear to be. Not sure who almost saw me there, but we weren't spotted, so that's good. There is a way up over soon. here. I have used a ball of sand. There is a bag of sand. But we have two guys standing right there who would probably or maybe see me. So we'll take the safer route. Oh, this goes back. Where the, where the heck am I going here? Oh, this is the... <laughs> This is our only way through, really? Okay, yeah, there is an, another opening. It's hard to see, but I think there is one there. It's kind of muddy. That was my only option, really. This games... <laughs> Game gave me one option there. Can we go? We can go somewhere from here, yeah? Oh, mechanism. Okay, we're not to it yet. Alright. Let's see, mechanism. 24 meters down a little bit. I think that's a stairwell over there. It's caught a chill. <clears throat> Do I need 
need some amber. That guy's got some amber. Is there anybody over here? Need to use my amber vision more to highlight guys. Let's hide in this barrel here. Wait for him to hopefully pass by us and we'll slip out and uh, grab his amber. Hopefully a prisoner doesn't see us and freak out, which is a possibility here, I think. I think. enough to where I can sneak across here. Let's get on our daggers. Walls, locks, latches, doors, gates. <sighs> These humans sure like locking each other up. All this is oh. making me nervous. The stuffy smell. When was the last time I breathed some real air? It was, uh... <sighs> I don't even remember. Goddamn headache. <clears throat> okay, so I think this is it. Yeah. I think the mechanism is right there through... Through those... Through that gate metal gate right there. How we're gonna get around these guys. Guess we can use invisibility to just walk right past them. Which I guess is what you're supposed to do a lot of the time. Um, instead of making life hard on yourself and uh, looking for another route, you know, that just takes longer. Oh, jeez, man. So many guys. So many guys. Jeez. Once again, I need to start looking around more. I do that a lot. You just gotta be aware in this game. The maps are huge. You have to literally, lo literally look everywhere before you proceed safely. So the, the other mechanism is just directly across. So uh, easiest way across. Okay. Uh, we have this guy patrolling back and forth to worry about. Shit. Thought I was gonna make that top one. Alright. Okay. Is it there? Anybody up there on that? Oh no. No, no, there's no way we can make that. Okay. Let's wait for this guy. Okay. I think there are guys that um try to catch you here. Ba -ba -ba! I need my quality of stealth features in this game. Where you can uh, toggle hanging off the ledge as you're dropping off. Jesus Christ. Uh, let's say, yeah. You know what would have been cool in this game? Um, I know they wanted to flow, uh, but I don't think their platforming is as good as they think it is. Um, so you know how, like in Deus Ex, um, the second one. Actually, fourth one. <laughs> the second newer Deus Ex. Um, how you can chart out your movement. 
see exactly. Where you're headed. All I want to do here is just drop off. You can see exactly the spot you're going to. You know. Um. It's okay. It was nothing. So in this game, I think one of those features would be nice, where you can see exactly where your character is going to land instead of, you know, having to just hope for the best, basically. I mean, it wouldn't be such an issue if they didn't make every single jump barely makeable. Just on the edge of his jump length. But uh, that's the way they designed it, so. So yeah. There's a guy coming back up here, I think. Um, let's see here. What are we doing next? There's a side side quest over here, may as well do that. Use this game. Phew. How do we get around this guy? Because he goes back and forth. Um, it's just pacing, just pacing back and forth. can't hide here and avoid using them. Um yeah, avoid using using up some amber by going invisible. He's going to notice that's gone and freak out immediately. So, I need to haul ass out of here once he passes. kind of did that with these hang on prompts the forward planning of movements Jesus Christ good thing he's wearing a hood otherwise he would have seen me um, I think we're headed in this direction. Should be able to slip through this room. Hmm. 
many guys are we dealing with in this room? Just those two. Yeah, there's a lot of exploration to do here, but you know, if you're um, not going the murderous route, not really going to be fun for you. So, do they have to crisscross? Do they really? Have to. I thought I was headed in this direction. Now it's pointing in that direction. <laughs> what? Uh, was I not headed? Maybe I was. Let's see. Oh, Jesus. I guess I was. Okay, I just got turned around. I was headed in this... Jesus, really? It looks so dark! Okay, well, he's walking this way now. He's not gonna see me. Looks so freaking dark, man. Oh my god, there's a guy that's gonna see me as soon as I come out of invisibility mode. Because I'm impatient. So impatient. Do, 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 do. So, so impatient. Do, 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 do. So, so impatient. You bastard. You're looking right, right where I need to go. Right where I need to go. Use another bottle of amber. Is anybody carrying a better amber? I don't think so. Anyway, some. Hmm. <gasps> so, what we're we gonna do here? <clears throat> Distract and run. Ta da! I like that trick. That's a fun one. <clears throat> I also think, also think a neat um, idea with the sand balls, which I don't think is a feature in the game. Would have been to throw one into somebody's eyes and they're like temporarily blinded because you know all the sand and grit is in their eyeballs and they're like rubbing their eyes and you can sneak around that way. That would have been cool. But uh, almost there. I just got across don't this area. Think. I should be in the high security section. I don't think it works that way. But Damn it. Um, what are they up to here? One thing sure, it's best not to be on the wrong side of the bars when I find out. I should really um, test it out after saying that, you know. What are we doing now? Go into the high security section. Where is the. Uh, where do we go from here? Exactly. <laughs> is this a. Oh. Man. Okay, um, 
think there's a secret area over there, but I don't really care. So. There's no sense to it. Why persist? Have they forgotten what happened at the creation of Akanash? Hundreds of dead? Workers like fools wandering this the guy has stopped no sense to it. It's no <sighs> dead in his tracks to talk to himself. All right. Okay. This seems a little bit too easy. Exactly. They hit a guy right behind a column. Dirty, dirty, dirty trick. And can I? Found nothing suspicious. Looks yeah. like there's something out there. That's that glitch right there. Can't see me, can't see me, can't see me. As soon as I move on the ledge, I guess it's the movement. I don't know. Ugh. Tell you what. Maybe if we do. No, you don't care about that, huh? You don't care. That is a dirty trick, though. Putting him right behind that. They knew exactly what they were doing there. And he has no patrol whatsoever. That's just his spot. That's just where he hangs out. Um. I guess we could try, try out the, um ball of sand trick with him where is this light even coming from the roots yeah you can't even target him so yeah that's not an option which uh, I think they missed out on a, a neat feature there. I really do. Extremely useful feature. So, yeah. Hey, if you can hear me, you better show yourself. Oh, that's nice. It's okay. It was nothing. Was it though? Was it really nothing though? Yeah, dick. I'm sure I heard is someone there or not. Nothing to report. Good. Let's get back to work. I just um wandered into a section I don't even need to be in. I think I have. And now I just have to backtrack out of here. Cause that, that room's a pain in the ass. Huge. Can't you kill these? Yeah. From the front, that's what I thought. That's the uh, symbol pointing me to the secret room up there. Maybe supplies in it. I don't, I don't know. I don't think guys should be able to see me through this. If they can, that's kind of garbage, but...
Can we get up there? Doesn't look like we can. Here we go. Yeah, I just trapped myself. Maybe I can get um what a mess this room is, right? Oh, so many guys. So much peripheral vision. Jesus. Who's almost seeing me here? Oh, God! I just wanted to get on top of this bookcase. Oh, well, maybe screwed here. I don't think that it's safely. There's just so many situations where you're just like, ah, oh, God, I don't think I can safely traverse this room. Like, just the way they set it up makes it so hard to get around. Like, look at the crisscrossing. Got one, like, line of, line of sight going that way. That that corner over there, they're crisscrossing. You've got this guy all over the place patrolling, and that guy over there patrolling as well. So, really, I mean... Maybe. See, you can't even slip around the peripheral, which widens the... Uh, it's not just straight line of sight. So there are like huge chunks. Well, just this entire... Basically the entire... This entire half of the room that I'm on right now someone can see you wherever you are so which means we're gonna have to use invisibility and not even make it with invisibility because we haven't upgraded that so um or just barely make it There's somebody over here. I don't think he moves, really. We are out of amber. Is there amber downstairs? You would think in a laboratory? Here's part of the problem, though. These lights down here. Oh, that is extinguishable. Uh, can I make this? Can I drop and make this? Um. Ooh, okay. There we go. Uh, amber. Well, that's kind of bullshit, right? Really? I'm in the darkness and you almost see me. There's zero... There's zero amber. Garbage. Pure. Pure. Garbage. Pure garbage. Such pure garbage. Don't care. They shouldn't have such fidgety patrols where they just pace. They pace. Stand in one place for more than two seconds. Don't even care. Don't care to stress myself out trying to thread the needle. 
through patrols. I don't care anymore. If I have to go through the rest of this game barely being spotted, fine. Yeah, they added that, um, the A prompting, like, there after the game came out, because people <laughs> just, they complained about the jank so much. So much. How many poor lost souls there are rushing in this maze? I think one of these guys... <clears throat> Around here. Oh, that's what they want you to think. Strange. I thought one of these. Oh, he does. Ooh. Found Ooh. Nothing oh. suspicious. Okay. Well, I hope he's. Mm. That guy's a little bit behind, lagging behind a little no, bit. There's nothing. Hopefully, this is dark enough to where I can. I'm up stuff. That one's mine. Excuse me. Now we might be dead, because we can't drink amber in here. I really thought... <sighs> okay, was he standing right above me? I really wish I knew his exact position. Here's the thing, like, he's on wood, walking around right above me. Why... Mentally, based on audio, don't I know his exact position based on wood creaking? I should, right? Oh, okay, that guy turned around. I'm dead. Alright, last auto save. That guy who never turns around turned around. Okay, okie dokie dokie dokie, okie dokie Auto save here? Before they spotted me, I hope. Yeah, they're just so... I mean, the audio, the audio is there. The audio is there, but it should it's right above me. It should be much, much louder. Uh, that may have been what happened right there, just the jankiness of the AI. I mean, that's so wonk. So, this isn't pitch, oh, oh, I guess I was right here, like, he must have, was he standing right there at the edge of the platform? How else would he have seen me? I mean, I'm a foot and a half off the ground, crouching? Anyway, anyway. I don't remember how I did this. I guess I had to go invisible to do this. have their buddies. They always have to walk around together. They did that on purpose because he's got a vial of amber and they knew you would want it. Ah, oh. all right. I can't see where I am. It's so bright in this room. Hey, buddy. See, I've got a buddy too, buddy. How you like that? You don't like that? Hmm? You don't like that, do you? 
Okay, so I'm not even going to go after that Violet Amber. It's really tempting, but, uh, screw it. Pause there every single time. If so, I can make it through here. I have to say, the game is much more enjoyable when you're just, uh. What about you? Me? It's six months since the beginning. A lot of stuff that could look like Ozcan's Brother Aaron at least here. knows what he wants. The governor should retire open. and leave the keys of Akanash to him. Yes. Alright, I get really... I get really angsty when the game uh, w tries to make me listen to conversations. I'm sorry. I may have been saying something important, but maybe not as well. Like, what is this? What... What is this? Does this happen on all difficulties? What is that? What is that? I think this is the you know what that is? Thing that wanted. That's uh, we put Where the bulb condenser back? here, so we're gonna have this guy spin like a top. He's gonna spin like a top and try to catch you and we're gonna put a chair here that's unavoidable nearly oh and that's not enough we're gonna have a guy patrolling through here as well oh my god this fucking game man this fucking game this fucking game mate There's a token right there. Don't care. <laughs> Gotta make it through here somehow. Mr. <laughs> With Mr. Top there. Ugh. Whoop. There he goes. Ooh. Whoop. There he goes. <laughs> I just <laughs> find that... <laughs> Utterly ridiculous. How can you not, really? I really want to kill him. <laughs> really do. <laughs> Where can we go here? I hope you can't see us here. I mean, we are lit up as if we're in darkness and hidden. And, I mean, that doesn't even stop them sometimes, though, from seeing you, so... i just like to make it through here. There are a hundred. <laughs> Look at this room. Look at this room. One, two, three, four. Probably more patrolling over here. And it's the daylight coming in. So I've got to get better blinds for this room. I've been putting off. Well, not really putting putting it off. It just um. I tried to get blinds, but, uh, you know, with COVID and the demand versus uh, the number of employees people have being next to none, it, it just, they never, never made it out to my place to set up the blinds or take measurements or whatever. 
Um, so we're just going this way? Can... Stealthy way? Um, we go up there. Of course, I think there's a guy at the patrolling up top, which complicates things. We can drop down. There are a couple guys, actually. There's a guy, like... Here as well, I want to say. Maybe not. Who the hell? Who? There's a guy patrolling up the stairs? And I just got lucky and he didn't. What? I'm gonna wait here a second. I've gotta know. Who? The, gut, the spinning top guy? I don't see anybody else. I guess it, yeah, I guess it was him. So I'm trying to save. Jesus game. At least he didn't outright see me, right? Okay, I've been playing about an hour. I can't see much of anything, so I think I'll... Yeah, it's just getting too bright outside. It's like, uh... I guess, um... My study room here is, is facing... facing east. So the sun's coming right in here and making it next to impossible to see what I'm doing. What the... What? <laughs> What? What? Uh, okay. Guess that's uh. I think that is a path later. Six. Stop floating. Yeah, I'm not. Able to see much of anything here. I need a knife. I need. I have zero amber. Oh. Jeez, what is the AI doing? That's just the AI like trying to path around, and uh, that's just a bug, and it's. Path. So stuff like that really detracts from the game. I really think they meant for you to like play, play the game, killing everyone and then snickering. This watch this guy. He's gonna. He's gonna see me. But what is it? Aha. Nice. I actually was able to get through there. Cool. I would love to spot some amber along my way here. Maybe that, uh, that guy has some. Sorry about all the annoying clicking sounds. I don't know why I'm doing that. So this room is just... Oh! A clusterfuck of patrols happening. Really? This noise prevents me from thinking. Got these two... And that guy too, yeah. Just a mess. What is on your shoulders that looks like barbed wire? What is that? What is that? Are those non-rendered parts of his model? Is that what that is? 
Okay, well, I was just being, like, stubborn. I, I knew that wasn't going to happen. I was just being stubborn there. So I'm just going to reload. Back to my old reloading tricks. Oh, God, my ears. Yeah, one of the downsides to having to wear glasses is that headphones really pinch. They really do pinch. I'm still trying to do it the stubborn way. Why am I doing that? Stop it. So that's the, um, that's the I have a lot of amber somehow invisibility way. And, uh... I don't know why I'm bothering with that torch. Because where I'm going... I don't really need that put out. This is the safe way. Of course, none of these ways are really safe because look at that. See? Crisscrossing patrols. May have got this place locked down tight. They're always on high alert. These guards never relax. Um, yeah. They never relax. Don't worry about that. That was a beetle that heard me on the other side of the wall. It's no problem, really. It can't get through the tunnel, so it's no problem. Cool. Just, oof. You know that you know that part in the Resident Evil movie where the laser grid traps the black guy in in the hall. Yeah, that's how I feel with their patrols and their lines of sight. <laughs> that's exactly how I feel. Exactly. Oh wow, look at that. Did you see that shit? See see what I mean about their patrols, like I think I did a fairly reasonable job. Of slipping through their patrols and then back behind that guy, but because they're so antsy, he turned around within like a few seconds of of walking over there. So, what the fuck, man? Anyway, I guess you can't corner kill when you're detected, right? Was I uncrouched? Because I've got, uh... I've got the ability that's supposed to quieten my falls. I'm supposed to soften my falls to where they don't hear that. I guess at uh, some point I uncrouched during all that chaos. But, um, yeah. But I guess they... Uh, Hmm. Expect you to thin out. A little silence. This noise prevents me from thinking. Look at this. Boom. I'm a genius. That was that was awesome. I guess if you're not annoyed with the fidgety controls, they like playing with their fruit before swallowing it. Well, hell, just as long as 
I'm not his breakfast. Difficult to imagine that one day our two species could become allies, but you never know. Um, of orcs and men, their other game. Sticks and an orc are partners. I've played it. It's a really neat concept, but the problem is, like this game, even more so than this game, it's brutally difficult. So much so that I couldn't even finish it. Like, uh, I don't know how you get through it, really. I really don't. It's, it's that difficult. Like, it's... There's hardcore games, and then there's... Like, that game is on a completely different level, I think. Are they on to me? Okay. So this is a little bit annoying. Um, you would think, oh, I can... Um, kind of softly, quietly drop. Drop here. And then come over here and jump up here quietly and then drop here and get through or is this possible oh okay I guess I was just trying to do it without I guess without waking him up at all. Okay. Come I bet on, Ragash. Find cell five for me, and be quick about it. I bet I was trying to. Um, cell five. I bet I was trying to roll off that top ledge into the sewer, the sewer pipe, probably. And uh, yeah, he just automatically grabs you. He doesn't uh, wake up and then go through a grab animation. It's just he wakes up and grabs <laughs> at the same time. So it's really Let's see. jank. Must be right at the other end of the prison. Some kind of dungeon or torture chamber. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm going to stop there. I'm going to stop there. And like I said, it's getting really bright. And it's been an hour anyway. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time for more sticks. Later.